Hi, the internet. Welcome to the What Else Show. I'm your host, Robert. This is Bethany. Hi, internet. And today we've got a brand new What Else Show for you. Bethany, what else are we talking about today? Today we're going to do another installment of Is It Gross? And we're going to try another food that we brought back with us from New Zealand. So thanks to our New Zealand friends for hooking us up with all kinds of fun foods to try. Today we are going to try... Marmite. Oh, yeah. This is a real contender for is it gross, isn't it? <laughs> I can almost say, yeah, yeah, it's going to be gross. I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't know what it is. It's like yeast. It's just like yeast and vitamins. No clue what, what it tastes like. Let me, let's look at the package and then okay. you can tell us why people eat it. And then we're, we have specific instructions on how to eat it. We'll deal with those. Yes. Okay. But let's talk about the packaging first. It's super boring. It's very, it's yeah. <clears throat> very boring. The only thing there is, is a little open, a little guy, a little Marmite guy. <laughs> just an open jar of marmite with feet and hands even that is like boring you know I mean? there's no it's just the hands and feet guy it's it's very nondescript packaging we've got these it's nutrition facts but they're in energies and kilojoules yeah. <laughs> so that's gonna we're be just, rough we're gonna skip all those but we can look at the ingredients and the number one ingredient is yeast wow that's and, interesting and then toward the end listed in the ingredients is like b3 b1 b12 b2 yes okay bethany why don't you tell us why people eat this yeah so people why people eat yeast yeah (laughs) so specifically people eat marmite because it is jam-packed with vitamins so it's essentially good for you it's stuffed full of B vitamins, including niacin, riboflavin, thiamine, ma- and magnesium, calcium, potassium, iron, and selenium, all of which are essential for g- good health. And Marmite is particularly good for pregnant people. That's what this well, I'm not pregnant. Why am I eating this? Uh, but it's overall, for, for general, overall good health. Okay, so first, you toast the bread. We toast bread. Toast the bread. And then you add a tiny bit of marmite to toasted bread to toasted bread okay and then you put some sliced cheddar cheese you put sliced cheddar cheese on top of the marmite on top of the bread toasted bread marmite cheddar cheese yes yeah so you just use a tiny so you just eat toasted bread marmite with cold cheese on top i don't like the sound of that that's what the instructions say. Like a cold Marmite cheese sandwich. A cold Marmite cheese sandwich. Okay. This will be interesting. I think you're reading the instructions wrong, but I have to go with what you said, Bethany. Oh, you want me to look at them? You double check. I didn't That's ask. That's what they say. I didn't ask for that, Bethany. How dare you hand me your phone? <clears throat> All right. Let's go. <laughs> let's go prepare this awful cold cheese on toast sandwich shall we my theory is that the cheese is going to warm up on the toast a little bit if we do it fast enough then if we put the cheese on the toast fast enough yeah i feel like it. but you're gonna have this cold cold layer of marmite between even that but it's not even really cold is it like it's not and it's and it's only a tiny bit of marmite but i think you have to put it in the refrigerator after you open it right i would i don't know anything about yeast yeah, you can look. I don't know. You can look, Bethany. You think you have better looking eyes no, than me? No, I just, I just. You think your looking balls are better than my looking balls? Huh? All right. Let's go. Let's go. Let's so, go. Let's, let's go so let's we can it. come back. Okay, we're back with our awful looking <laughs> cheese on toast. <laughs> with our awful looking cold cheese on toast. <laughs> There's marmite in the middle of there. I don't know if we use enough. It doesn't seem like it to me. I don't know if we use too much. It doesn't seem like it to me. It's hard as hell. Hard as hell. I was kind of interested in the viscosity of this uh, of this product. I wanted yeah. you to see. Uh, I don't know if you can see that, but it's... Uh, it's kind of like hot fudge. It looks like hot fudge. hot fudge. I bet it does not taste like hot fudge. <laughs> Oh, Lord. Okay. <laughs> I, I kind of got a little bit of a whiff of it, but I didn't really stick my nose in there. All right. Smell. Let's give it a smell. I'm actually not really getting anything. Yeah, it doesn't really... 
not so very pungent. A, no, no. Which I'm a little relieved because maybe that means it'll be like maybe my really mild flavor. I don't know. So so we have our cheddar cheese on top of the marmite on top of the toast. <laughs> yes. So do we should we just yeah i mean let's in? just dig in i don't think there's enough on there so that i'm going to be able to taste it so what's going to happen is i'm not going to be able to taste it and then you're going to have to eat a spoonful to let us know what it tastes like i'm gonna have to eat a spoonful yeah so you can let us know what it tastes like <laughs> shut up and eat your toast robert <laughs> okay there's toast All with right. a cold piece of cheese on top yeah Fun. You know what the problem, one of the problems is, is I don't know what toast with a cold piece of cheese on top of it tastes like. So I might not be you able just to tell the you difference. You can't just figure it out yourself. Like, I haven't even bitten into any of the Marmite yet. Like, if you just look under your slice of cheese. We didn't use enough, I told you. We followed the instructions. You said you wanted to follow the instructions. So that's what we did. I mean, I'm definitely finished with it and I've, I didn't taste it at all. Maybe our cheddar is too sharp i definitely got some by your face it's really good so here's my suggestion i think we should just each try a small spoonful a spoonful a small like just each try a small taste okay yeah yeah let's do right. that okay i'll go get us some spoons all right i'll wait i'm waiting for bethany i should probably only have to wait well it's spoons are right downstairs so I'll probably be waiting about 30, 45 minutes. She gets distracted and is slow. Even if she wasn't distracted, <laughs> we're looking at a good five minutes to go downstairs, get spoons, come back upstairs. Oh my God. You're going to be lucky it doesn't take all day. 24 hour period just to get some spoons. So I got us some spoons. We're back with spoons. Back with spoons. <laughs> and we're going to just try it. Just a small. Straight out. Yeah. Straight from the tap. So so I'll be honest. I was eating it. And I, I got a big bite of Marmite with the cheese and the toast. And it, it, it was, tastes, it tastes really bad. It was not good. Okay, so we're just going to do a little bit. Just a little bit because I am very curious what it's going to taste like. What we throw like. up? <laughs> well, uh, no. It wasn't that I mean, bad? I mean, I had... Um, <laughs> it was... It was uh, <laughs> I was not having a party. Okay, well, I'm going to see how much you were going to Okay, gonna I'm just going to take like a small... Just a tiny bit. Just a tiny bit? Just a... Well, you take however much you want. I right? don't want any, Bethany. <laughs> But we should try it. We should try it All right. on its own. See, I've got a little bit. Can you even see? I've got such a little tiny bit that it might not even be showing up on camera. But then he has less than me. Yeah. Should I get a little more? I'll get a little more. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Ready? Yeah. And do we just tongue first? That's what I, I'm going to do. Cheers. Do. Cheers. Oh, it's very strong. Oh, yowza. <laughs> okay, so. It's a lot saltier than I thought it was going to be. Oh my God, it's so salty. Yeah. It's so salty and it's, it's very strong. Uh, yeah, so I definitely bit into it and I could taste it and I just was like, nope, I can't, I can't. Here's, let me, hmm. Oh. Here's my problem, right? The, with the, with the product. Okay. Besides the flavor. <laughs> okay. All right. And I don't really think it's healthy for you. I think it's a trick, <laughs> but here's my main problem. Okay. Is that it's too concentrated. It's extremely concentrated. Yeah. Why isn't it less concentrated and more of a spread? You know what I mean? Yeah. Like you would do peanut butter, right? Like you could, you put peanut butter on an entire right. slice of toast. You don't put a dot of peanut butter. Yeah. Right. Have it less concentrated and just put it all over your toast and get a little bit of the flavor. Yeah, we should be mixing with this with something yes. so that we have can like really layer it on so we get a tiny little bit in, in every bite. Yeah. We should Although, make a sauce out of it. <laughs> you are a sauce guy. I am a sauce guy. He's a sauce guy. So yeah, I don't I don't like it. I'm gonna have to call this one gross. 
Obviously, it's gross, Bethany. It's it's unwieldy. <laughs> it is. Have we ever had any <laughs> any products that were unwieldy? Yeah, and now I understand why the instructions we were given was just to put a little bit. Right. Don't overdo it. Now it makes sense. But the problem is that when you just put on a little bit, it's hard to spread it evenly all over the toast, right? So you take a bite and you just get a mouthful of Marmite. Right. That's the problem. The the evenness of the spread. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's a problem. I, did, I didn't even taste it the first time. Yeah. And I think that maybe our cheddar was also too sharp because it was had a very... It was very flavorful, mm -hmm. so I think we missed some of the taste of the it, Marmite. Yeah, or I did anyway. So you were thinking it just tasted like cheese on toast, right? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And I mean, this is it. it would, like immediately when I bit into it, I knew I was like, "Yep, that's Marmite," and I do not like it. Yeah, uh, I mean, I, I <laughs> it was bad. I'm just confused about the product. I can't, I can't use it. You know? Yeah. Like, how am I supposed to use this? Yeah. But I mean, I don't know. I guess that's why it's not popular right. here, <laughs> right? Yeah, it's it's, it's not it's, popular in the United. This is not something we eat in the United States because it's too concentrated. <laughs> it's got to be thinned out. <laughs> why isn't there Marmite mayonnaise? Oh, see, that's a better idea. Yeah. 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 An actual, yeah, like you were saying, an actual spread. Yeah. Yeah. So, um. Marmite cream cheese. I could go all day. Oh, yeah. That's... Marmite Thousand Island dressing. <laughs> Marmite ranch. Come on. These are easy, oh guys. Oh, my God. You can just keep going. So, yeah, it's it's gross. I will not be able to eat Marmite this. Marmite sour cream. Oh. <laughs> <sighs> Maybe maybe I need to do some tests. Ooh, I was expecting more of a yeast flavor. Yeah, it's just super salty. I think it yeah. was like my eyes are watering. <laughs> yeah, I could. Yeah, it's yeah. Just, you're it's just very salty. <laughs> it's so. It's. I yeah. I was really expecting like a yeasty, bready kind of flavor, not a punch to the face with salt and. There's like an odd smoky flavor in there too. I don't know. Like I was weird... just. There was just such a hard salt, salt flavor that yeah. I think it covered up everything else. Yeah. It way too concentrated for us. Yeah. Yeah. Look at I didn't even like finish mine on my spoon. That is shocking because Because it just hit me so hard. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Robert is not one to, you know, shy away from finishing something. I think it's still stuck it's... in my teeth. <laughs> My teeth are so salty right now. This was so. This was really interesting, though. It is this interesting. Really it's not interesting. Good. You know what the problem is? Is I'm not. I'm not a hundred percent sure on the health benefits of this of this product. You know what I mean? I feel like you could eat other things that are better, like a B complex vitamin. <laughs> yeah, just take a vitamin. Just you know, just take a vitamin. This is. Yeah, I mean, I'm not. I'm not yeah. over the moon on the, the health benefits. I don't even know if they're true. But I feel like maybe if I was, maybe I'd be on board. But since I'm not, not really on board, I don't know what I'm going to do with this. Maybe I'll use it. Maybe I won't. Depends if I'm feeling crazy or not. Yeah. Yeah. It depends on what mood you're in. Yeah. But yeah, uh, yeah it's gross. It's gross. Yeah. It's definitely gross. To, to be fair, you're not supposed to eat it right out of the jar like a crazy person. Well, I know, but... Maybe we, some people do. But I needed you you're to... super tough. I really needed you to taste it. And I was like, I, I kind of want to try it. I was very like morbidly curious. What does this taste like just straight out of the jar? How do people eat this? <laughs> yes, exactly. And I really wanted you to get a taste of it because you got zero of it on your toast. Yeah. And I, I felt like I really got it on my toast. So maybe we should have just done it on the toast with no cheese. Yeah, but like that's not how they eat it, though. They put who, cheese on it. Who knows? This is just one person, Bethany. Mm, this no. is just one crazy lady in New Zealand. <laughs> one crazy. Our cra this is our crazy friend in New this Zealand eats more money. One New Zealand wackadoo that you're taking <laughs> information hey, from. Hey, <laughs> hey, Sarah. He didn't mean that. We love you. <laughs> You're amazing. We love you. Um, Should I take us out? It's gross. It's gross. We don't have anything yeah. else to say I have, about this. I have nothing else uh, to my say. My eyes won't stop watering. And I, <laughs> yeah, I, I need a carbonated fizzy. I need a fizzy drink, <laughs> Sarah would yeah. say, as soon as possible.
Take us out, Robert. Thanks for watching, Internet. You can follow the show on Twitter at What Else Show. We're also on Instagram at The What Else Show. Please like, subscribe, and share on YouTube. If you've ever tasted Marmite or think you have an idea of what Marmite might taste like, no, no, just leave a comment. If you have any, if you have, if you know how to use it, if you know how to use the the buttons on your phone or computer, just leave us a comment. Bye, yeah. Internet. <laughs> Bye, Internet. <laughs> Oh, you just, you were looking at me funny. I didn't know if I was doing the right thing. I don't know if you're doing the right thing.